We we're on our way to the Walmart. It's about five miles away from here. We saw the Sam's Club over here. We were still gonna drive and I called Louis on the radio and I said, you know what, why don't we just pull over and stay at the Sam's Club? Because this rig is here and they look like they're gonna overnight and there's a truck that was here. There's a truck over here. And I said to him, let's just pull over in there because he wanted to have pizza today. And I thought, well, it's really late already. It's about it's almost seven. So we um, parked here. We're going to go inside and get pizza before they close the store. So that works out really well for us if that happens. And tomorrow we'll take the rest of our trip down to the beach. It's getting a little chilly, so I had to put on the shirt. Anyway, we're off. because it's the rip tides are so bad today and we can't really go in the water i'm going to go and back in over there so at least we can edit and do some work and have a beautiful view of the water oh we're already moving this is the rv parking at coquina beach i thought we we're going to stay at the parking space that we're at right now which is meant for rving in coquina beach it was set for me to go this way oh. i'll go this way i'll do the opposite of what he said gonna help me back in here now so that way we have a view how was the ride really good so rv parking's over there but look i was able to park here awesome because it's too cold to go in the water today anyway this is why i have a truck camper because i couldn't get into spots like this those rvs where i was over there that's rv parking but those rvs are over there and i'm able to have a spot like this and i could sit here at my table and edit a video even though the weather's too breezy today and I have the ocean I can hear the ocean I can watch the ocean yeah, I can fun. watch the boats pass by this is my view from Coquina Beach all the way at the edge oh, I got it I got it I got it it's very hard to come down with this little shelf here cooking some of that rotisserie chicken we had left over hmm? That looks good. And then I'm also steaming some broccoli so we can have an early dinner. It's a view from my kitchen. Hmm? Breezy, breezy, breezy today. chicken with some of the rotisserie chicken that was left and then I made a broccoli salad with tomatoes and was that gouda cheese smoked gouda cheese and we're having naked juice and some sourdough bread you see the people in the mirror they're at the little beach over there you eat the skin the skin has all the flavor Ugh. Coquina Beach. Coquina Beach. is a kind of stone. Yeah. yeah. Nobody coming on this side? No one coming from my side.
get off to Planet Fitness for showers today because there's a lot of humidity in the air. And then we're going to head out to the Cracker Battle overnight. Most of the day we just spent driving because we went to Siesta Beach. And Siesta Beach, although it is beautiful and the town is gorgeous, there there's no space for us to park. There's no, there's no space there for RVs to park. And the municipal parking where you can park for the beach is very small. It's, just, it's for really small cars and stuff. So we just left there because we knew how nice this is. We had already been here before. Where we went today was nice because I can actually get really close to the water with the, with my camper. So I guess a lot of the traffic that's out now here in this area is people who wanna watch that beautiful sunset that's coming down. Hey guys, if you enjoy my videos, please give me a thumbs up. Thanks for watching.